So here's a movement that I like to do during a treatment uh, to help people with shoulder flexion. So while I'm talking to them and I'm working on their arm and we're talking about uh, the issues that they've been having, um, I'll just work through it and then I'll actually bend the arm and I'll take the shoulder up into flexion, talking to them the whole time, just watching to see how they react. Do you feel any discomfort with that, John? No. Good. So then I just hold them and then can you extend your arm? So now we've got them in shoulder flexion but they're not having any discomfort with it, which is what we're really going for. So then I'll just keep moving the shoulder passively. And then I'll get it into a little bit of a greater range. Then can you extend your arm again? Any discomfort with that? No. Nope. Excellent. So you can keep working through that until you, act, you eventually can get the arm all the way up here and have them extend. And you've got them in full shoulder flexion which is that movement that they were worried about when they came in. So just adapting that a little bit and getting them moving can make a huge difference with uh, shoulder flexion with those movements.